In 1941, German intelligence officers stared at reconnaissance photos in disbelief. At a British factory in Hatfield, a new bomber was taking shape, but it was made of wood. The news spread through Luftwaffe headquarters, sparking ridicule. Had Britain really run out of aluminum? Hermann Gring himself reportedly joked that the British were building bombers out of kindling, a sign of utter desperation. German propaganda had a field day, mocking what they called the plywood panic. Pilots were told these wooden planes would likely fall apart in combat. The German high command was convinced Britain was scraping the bottom of the barrel out of both materials and ideas, but they were missing a crucial piece of the puzzle. What they couldn't have known was that months earlier, in November 1940, a bright yellow prototype of this wooden wonder had already taken to the skies, proving everyone wrong.